That's what it looked like this afternoon, floating from east to west over town. It was way up there, all right, some 25 miles over our heads, the Air Force later told me. The giant helium-filled balloon eventually collapsed, falling to earth like a thousand pounds of cellophane, landing on the Gila Indian Reservation southwest of Phoenix. A short while later, we spotted this, a large parachute, perhaps 100 feet across, Dangling beneath it was some sort of a silver box that made a rather hard landing. This is what had been attached to that balloon we would later find out. There were no markings on it, no way at all of telling what it was. Then the Air Force pulled up. Excuse me, we don't mean to be too nosy, but about a million people in Phoenix are dying to know. What is it? What is it? Yeah. <laughs> this is a scientific payload that was launched from Mahalaman Air Force Base in New Mexico. How, how far are we? About 400 miles? Okay, it went up to uh, approximately 125,000 feet in the air, uh, carried aloft by an 11 million cubic foot balloon. So there you have it, an Air Force experiment to gather information on gases in the upper atmosphere. Thank goodness it was one of ours.